Good evening, I'm Rob Johnson. And I'm Erica Sargent. A huge turning point tonight for Chicago's fight to land Amazon's second headquarters and a potentially big boost for Chicago's employment future. Amazon putting its second headquarters here could bring as many as 50,000 jobs. That's enough to fill every seat at Wrigley Field and put 8,000 more on the field. Further perspective here, that's five times more than Archer Daniels Midland, Boeing, Exelon, and United Airlines combined, the four largest companies headquartered in Chicago. Tomorrow, leaders from both the city and the state head to Seattle to begin their push for Amazon. CBS2 political reporter Derek Blakely picks up our story. Just back from his first Asian trip to reel in new businesses, Governor Rauner acknowledged the big fish is now Amazon. And that's a catch he can only lure by cooperating with his political sparring partner, Mayor Emanuel. We've got um, a, a city-state joint um, group going to Seattle tomorrow. Deputy Governor Leslie Munger will be Rounders Point person. Deputy Mayor Robert Rivkin will lead Mayor Emanuel's team. It's essential that we work together as a partnership. Amazon wants single, comprehensive um, a proposal. According to Rauner, Amazon is only seeking bids from major urban areas with major international airports. That leaves a limited number of geographic areas that have access to global markets, transportation, uh, talent, software talent. Uh, so it puts us in a position of pretty competing against maybe one or two other cities. Potential locations include the old Michael Reese Hospital site and the old Finkel Steel site. Also, this plot south of Roosevelt along the Chicago River and the downtown Thompson Center. We have been our own worst enemy with our policies, with our regulations and our taxes. Now the governor who spent years recounting Illinois shortcomings must become the state's super salesman. We have a great uh, workforce. We have great people, the best people in America. That delegation heading to Seattle will visit Amazon's offices, but they won't be meeting with Amazon executives. Instead, they'll be taking a look at Amazon's current headquarters to get a better idea of which Chicago site might best fit Amazon's needs. And on the political front, we'll all be watching to see if the governor and the mayor can cooperate well enough to get this deal done. Rob and Erica, there is a lot on the line. Yeah, they're going to send their deputies at first, but at some point, if this process goes along, they are going to have to be in the same room together, being united. True? Well, eventually, you have to bring in the closers, but right. we're not in that stage yet. Oh, to hear those conversations when they come, though. <laughs> Thank you, Derek. <laughs>